you know, I, I, I move the camera over as he's like grabbing. Hi everybody, what's going on? Welcome to Quick Draw Bra 21. I don't remember which one we're at. Dude, they have the peanut butter crap. Yeah. I, I remember these. Yeah, Kai's sick. So you guys are good to go. So we have. I, I say that they're good to go, and we're not. Uh, Alright, which one of us is Benji Cake and which one is Toons? Neither. <laughs> that, that's cursed. Is it, with, is it two N's and two I's? I always forget. Yeah, it's two N's and two I's. Okay, good. I'm not completely brain dead. Alright, good, I got them on the right side. Check. Yeah, a little bit of a button check, you know. And it's not Grand's. No, you're right, it is not Grand's. This is, um. Winner's semi-finals? Question mark? No, this is what is quarters fine. Quarter fine. So we got winners quarters coming up real quick. With Salty and Uchiha. Uchiha making it out finally for the first time in a little bit. Yeah, it's been a long time since I've seen Jeremy. Very happy to have Jeremy out here. It's kind of I'm a little sad because on paper, before we started, this was going to be the biggest quick draw at 32 people, mm. but a lot of people had to pull out, unfortunately. So, I, understandable for some, Silent was unable to make it. Also, happy birthday, Silent. Well, is, happy birthday, Silent. It is the man's birthday. He's, I'm not going to tell how old he is. And, of course, because Salty's playing, it's, we're going to get a little part, even though we're not on that play anymore. But Salty running the Seth. This is Uchiha's Bordeaux. All right, opening Gambit. Yeah, I'm interested to see how uh, Uchiha goes about doing this matchup. Because I feel like, just in general with Seth, he's just like a character that you could just walk around against. But Gord actually has some options to reach up there, so I don't know what he's going to do. Oh, the faint step. That was super sick. Block shielded. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Uh-oh, stinky. Oh, drops him, unfortunately. Oh, wow. Well, God, okay. these purple shields. Well, oh, nice. I feel like Ichiha doesn't know what he wants to do yet on offense. It kind of looks like. Oh, no, that 2 2 whiff. Oh, oh, my God, that's stuck. He said sit down. Woo! I love that that crumples. Okay, high damage. This, okay. this is the part One where touch. you don't do anything. I think. Oh, sad. Okay. Yeah, he tried to oh, backdash, and that uh, Grim Reaper is going to catch that ending of it. Although it was interesting, he did B Reaper after. Uh... Jeez. Just... <laughs> okay. That hit's so weird. Burn that meter. Yeah, you're eating this uh, 3.6. Oh my god, he's in this. Actually, now that I think about it, that was the most privileged 2C of all time. Yeah, for sure. He's not a nerd Fox. like me that holds like down back for the two C. He just holds the two. It's just auto corrected. Oh, he's 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 got him in jail. Okay. So he's a little bit in trouble yeah, here. Yeah, he's not gonna win grid for yeah. for that. Oh my god! I kind of feel like he's just killing himself a little bit. Yeah. Salty's gonna. We we didn't tell Salty to go Seth, but that's oh, because I believe that this would be a good matchup. Oh, oh that's not a no. good board set. Yeah, yeah, you hate to see that. Oh, it's fucking Gordo, man. Oh, sorry, I just, I, I just lost control. Man, I love the like. I love the design of Quick Draw Brawl, like of its elements and like stream elements and stuff. Thank you. Yeah, Blue did a Blue did a fantastic job and worked on, on this project. Yeah, they've they've got an eye for design, that's for sure. Absolutely. I don't know what happened. I lost lost camera for I feel like we didn't really see anything about the matchup in that set, like, at all. 
No, it was pretty uh, scrambly to be completely honest. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. There we go. I wish I knew anything about the matchup, but I feel like it's not very common. I don't know about these days, but when I was still playing, there really were not that many sets. And even fewer Gordos, I think. Hey, can y'all pause real quick? I'll go let him know. Because this is a matchup I know a little bit more about. All right. Anyway. Oh, what, what a weird like. Was that a combo drop or like a setup or something? Probably a setup, I would imagine. Oh, the shield. Oh. Really good shield. From the there. That, that, that was. It, it's really important to be able to get that like shield on the two C so that you can get enough space to jump over the fireball. That was pretty nice. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. They're even on meter right now, but there's a pretty huge grid lead from Gordo, so... I, oh, he's, he's not gonna die for that. I think he will. Oh, yeah, super. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, make me, make me a liar. He, he kind of got punished a bit for dash blocking there when he probably should have just been holding one. Yeah. Oh, there you go, that dash again. He's not, it, it looks like Jeremy's having a hard time adjusting to like dash and then a buffered button. Okay, oh good my goodness. Good VO. That was really good. Nice. Good catch. I'm not going to be able to burn all of it. Yeah. I don't agree with that. I'd rather get turbulence instead of that. Oh, catch is, um, probably doing something. Well, he has so much meter. I feel like he might want to just like spend it after the cycle finishes here. Uh, he lost all of his blocks. Well, not all. Oh, no, <laughs> dude, he's, he's, he's not policing it, bro. It's hard to police, to be fair. Oh, nice. Yes. Cycle. Oh, yeah, he gets Jeremy. the cycle there. Uh, that? No, it's not that. Oh, no, he drops too. Uh oh. Yeah, that's making save. Oh, catches him. Oh, oh catches the back dash. Damn, that caught the back dash. What a big button. Yeah. Oh, okay. Jeremy's awake at least. Yeah. That 2B says I'm watching you. How's he gonna win this cycle though? Is he gonna does he even care? Oh god. He does not care. Am I gonna hear? No. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. I oh. he didn't recognize that it was a whip air throw. I wonder I wonder what he was trying to do there. Oh no, Salty the put it there. He did not want that I know for that for sure. Mash now! Scary. He can't be out. Oh, he does mash out. Oh my oh, god. god. Oh, he's dead. Rip. Rest in peace. Uh, okay, okay. So... Jeremy can win if he adjusts against the dash block, like, delay button. Mm -hmm. And just... I, I think he's getting most of his wins from just, like, neutral. So I feel like it's okay for him to just be, like, maintaining that distance. He'd probably do pretty well to stay that way. For sure. Oh, okay. So he gets this cycle. I'm, I'm expecting it to just like string it oh, up. No, oh he no! Messed up no. the two two A. Oh, messing up that meaty hurts. Okay, yeah, oh. he's gonna be able to get out of that situation. That was an all or nothing move right there. Oh, oh my god, the mash! Salty doesn't care. He's not scared. Yeah, well, it's not like he's gonna die from mashing there. True. But he eat a grip of damage. It's true. Okay, go in the corner. Hope you're ready for this 2k. He Is he just it. gonna spend the cycle? I feel like he should just spend it for some meter right now. It was so young. Oh, oh. no, the mash out. Uh, Gore doesn't have a way to, to mash out of these situations. Oh. But it's just slow. That T2, I think it's Oh, that's, yeah. that's rough. That's dead. Oh, no, the whip. Oh, the whip. He gets the okay. combo. Scary. God, crush me. <laughs> That's so cursed. That was so cursed. The 2B reaches farther. 
Oh my god! Oh god. Was that 5B? That, yeah, I think that, that was 5B. That stuffed it out. Holy. Nice shield. Oh, oh the back dashes. Gord has a good one. I like it. I, I like the chain back dashes to get the distance. You lose the cycle, but... Oh, oh. god. Probably doing a uh, dash move. Oh, no. Was Stops he even it. doing a move there? How do you, like, even get hit? Uh, it, it was a startup of it, but, like, the first, like, two frames of the startup. So no oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's a Gord player right there. That's a two pad. Oh! oh net play. Lord! Hit him with a net play. Okay, do some, do something cringe? Uh, that's, yeah, okay. Gee, oh. Whoa, that's pretty cringe. Oh no! But he gets mashed on. But he's, he's still not thinking about the, the dash block button. That whiffs, yeah. Oh. No! I don't know why he did do so! He could have he won that if he didn't do that. Oh, oh my he, God! He's a two, he's a he's a gourd player. See, see, that's, he's a gourd player. Dude, see, that's what I'm talking about. He's getting those he's getting those hits a lot. Although that was kind of the first time that I think he was. Oh, oh, oh scared! Oh, oh, you actually you actually got hit by that. Oh my God! He drops it. Tag. Oh, okay. Oh, Much factor. Ah! Give him the boot. Yakuza oh, kick. Oh, you can't okay, mash okay. Okay, there's some momentum there. Yeah. There's some momentum there. I think Uchiha might have figured something out. Let's see. Oh, yeah, plus, plus. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, he, he did figure it out. He's he's delaying the button. He's not catching it, though, but but it's hard to catch. Okay. Oh! Okay. Oh, oh, another drop. Oh! Oh. Oh, oh. Uh oh, okay, stop, uh, stop doing that. Uh. Okay. Oh, uh. 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 oh he's dead. Rest in peace. You're dead. Gordo! Oh, that's yeah, that was a nail biter. That's a sick as hell. Well, like in that last oh, game. Oh wait! In that last game, he really made like. I, I think he. I think he kind of identified his win condition a little yeah, bit there. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that was. Yeah, policing dash block buttons really hard. I feel like, I don't know, I feel like a lot of the time against the dash block delay button, you just have to like string them up again and push them back out. Hi. It's, it's so, it's so scary to have to call out. Damn. I don't know, I'm not sure. So we got our next, are we going to start doing a uh, says buttons are cooked? I don't think so. Uh, I don't think buttons are cooked. Yeah. That, that was the end of the set, it was 2-1. Yeah. yeah. Uh, they, he was gonna check something, but. Banger set, dude. I think he just wanted banger. to switch the color to the Joker color. Uh, I think he just entered his Joker art. I oh, probably. No. Like the... That's what happens when I played this game. Did he realize that we live in a society? <laughs> yeah. I can't believe so it. So we're starting uh, uh, top eight matches? Yeah. Next, you wanna be on stream? I have to be on stream. It's top eight. Oh. Um, you know what? That's a pretty good point. <laughs> um, I'm gonna. Is Toons out? I'm gonna take that she as a. I'm gonna get Tunes no! over here. Okay. No, Rena. Speaking of which, hey, look, if that set was sick, and I know it was sick, why don't you uh, do me a favor real quick? Just throw me a little extra point. Uh, that's not Match Reno. I can't do it. Uh, there were some suspicious links that you just put into the chat there, y'all. That was, that was not it. That was crazy. That was the bracket. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Yes. Sorry. Give me. In like two minutes, and I'll be able to meet you in a second. Sorry, that was our that was our glorious owner of Rank One Gaming. Speaking of which, hey, oh, that's you're the in owner. Carol. Yes, yeah, the owner. If you haven't been to um, Carrollton, Texas? You should come out. K Town is here. It's sick, and they got Rank One, which is a really really sick uh, PC cafe. That's where we host this place at. And owner is very gracious. He is the reason why there's a fifty dollar pop bonus per game. So thank you very much, Sam, for that. Oh boy, Pesto was looking at me, ready to like. I was actually gonna game. comment on Zenny's. Oh, okay, yeah, <laughs> that I too. To see the flag. Looks oh sick. yeah, the flag is sick. Looks the so flag sick. is sick. This is our, it, this is our backdrop. Cool We're gonna probably get one for the uh, player side too. Nice. It'll probably just be like the uh, skull and um, cowboy hat logo yeah, instead. But I, yep. I, if, I, oh sorry. Go ahead. I saw Aura had one of those stickers on his stick too. You want a sticker? What do I get? Yeah. For me. 
How much? What's what's the number? Uh, two dollars. That's an expensive sticker. That's an it. Two brother, dollars. brother, what? It's a piece of paper and glue. Bro. Two well, if, if it's a piece of paper and glue, then how about you make it yourself? Ooh. <laughs> I'm already sending him the money. You support your locals. Money. Support your locals. Cash up's already open. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you're in Carrollton, if you're in Texas, really, DFW, come to rank one. It's a sick venue. Um, if you're into Valorant and stuff like that, they've got setups and they have Valorant tournaments sometimes. So, there's that. But um, we're going to get into it with our next game, which I believe is going to be me and Pesto. Which is Hi, besties. Crazy. Hi, can you run the stream? Uh, sure, I can also commentate. Cool, because we need to run um, me and Pesto. Oh, cool. So, Hello. Thank you, everybody. I will see you all later. Hello, I'm here on the mic now. After my appearance on Blaze Blue and Melty Boy, how's video? Games? It was a decent set. Um, Salty played his sets first. Mm -hmm. Kind of didn't really look like either of them really knew what they wanted to do, and it was a really awkward game for the first one. But uh, Uchiha took it. And then Salty took the second game on his Akatsuki. Um, and then Uchiha came back. And, oh yeah, and then Uchiha came back for the third one with a, kind of a big adjustment. Okay, that makes sense. I was talking to Uchiha earlier, and he hasn't played Uni in a while. He's been focusing super hardcore on Melty Blood. Yeah. So he was like, I was talking to him like way before Bracket started today, and he was like, oh, I. Like, I guess I'll play uni. I'm here, I'll play uni. I don't really know, like, what I want to do with stuff, though. So... He, he was saying that? Yeah, he was saying that. So it was one of those things where it's like, oh yeah, he probably hasn't touched this in a while. Yeah. So I, that's probably where all, like, the weirdness was coming from. Yeah, that's kind of what I was seeing, because... At least for the first game... Get in there, dude! Uchiha was definitely like, uh, <laughs> just like... It's just like, stuff. oh, things, things are happening. Mm -hmm. Um, who is on stream? I don't know. Who is doing this? Oh, it's Atlas and Pesto. Let me type that up. Atlas I'm trying. Omega versus Pop and Pesto. I'm trying to think if they played each other, like at Quick Draw specifically, because it sounds like it's happened before, right? Probably. There's not that many people here. Yeah. I'm sure it's happened. Uh, Yo, do y'all care if I ban Randy? Uh, Randy is like... Probably. Fu oh wait. But t time him out for like two minutes. Oh, I see. I see what this is. No, okay. he, he timed me out for two minutes in another stream. So that's but, so BM. Actually. Yeah, we, we gotta we gotta get it the other way around. Oh, that Here. that's so BM. Goodbye, Randy. Uh, I think it's the bottom left. The like the cancel button. Button check. Okay. Like right there, I think. Oh, that's a ban. Okay, yeah, it's the timeout. The timeout's what we want. Uh, let's do... 10 minutes, that's really long. Wait, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. God, it's no, too no, late. No, 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 no. <laughs> um, don't do that. Get destroyed. Don't, don't do that. Okay. Get destroyed, Randy. Damn, I'm I'm so sorry. Yo, what the hell? Is that Hobby? Get him, too. Get hot! Oh no! Uh, I'm not a tool of your revenge. I'm sorry. Uh, we're gonna be getting into Papa Pesto versus uh, Atlas Omega. Quick draw brawl, Atlas Omega. Oh yeah, and uh, Pesto's playing as Borier. He said he wanted to pick up Borier for fun. Why he would do that, I don't know. But clearly, he's enjoying playing. This is like. Well, not anymore. I was gonna say, this is like kind of the hard part and a little bit of the matchup is like when Wag finally gets you and takes you to the corner because he's Wagner. And then uh, your buttons are on the slow side of Zori, so it can be hard to defend. Um, is it Zinny with one eye? Mm -hmm. Two. When, two oh. And Papa Festa is getting hit right now. Where's
Isn't yeah. three bad now, Pesto? This is definitely looking super rough right now. Oh shit, they can hear me. <laughs> yeah, no, you, everybody is very hearable in this venue. Um, beware your shit talk. It, it can get smoked very easily. Um, definitely something that Pesto is definitely having to like react to is the fact that Atlas just plays this character. I think is like the largest problem. You mean like he, he, he's like playing, Atlas he's playing a sub, so it's gonna be harder. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Like Atlas. Oh god. Okay. Oh my eyes. All right. Uh, should, Convert. All right. There we go. Oh my god. Air series. Yeah. Spin Trust. the bar. <laughs> What's the round start? Sweet mother of god. Poirier is coming in. Ooh. Oh, the, the throw is a little slow. Oh my god, Pest doesn't mash. Yo, Atlas, frame trap this guy. It's not getting hit. Atlas oh. is in kind of a rough spot right now. Yeah, it, it could be better. Oh, yeah, uh, no, no way you get that one. Yeah, going going for that throw there really, like, tip the cycle not in his favor. Oh, but he's going to get the grid break, but oh, no convert. God. Papa Pesto, th this must be sabotage. <laughs> he said it's the PS4 Pro. The PS4 Pro allegations, oh, no. See, never play against an Aurier player on the PS4 Pro. It's unwinnable. Oh my god, footsies. Oh no. <laughs> oh my. Footsies again. God, her 5B is such a big button. Yeah. These are two big 5B users. Oh, sweet. Oh. oh, no punish on that. Oh. That's so sad. Getting hit by the overhead. This is Atlas's time to actually, like, do some damage. Oh, the... Oh, my God. He was able to steal the cycle there. Yeah, okay. They take sword. That's fine. Oh, what the... He blocks it all. Oh, uh, that was plus. That was plus. Where what was a the jab. frame trap? What a jab. Oh, trying to whiff punish the 5B with the sweep, but it's not really working out there. I also need to press 6B in the, the 5A trade situations. The 5B is just gonna get out of space. Mm -hmm. Oh. Cancels it really early. Oh, nice here. Ooh, actually getting a, like a full convert there, normalizing it, and getting cycle. That's really nice. Yeah, you don't see those too often against Laurier. Most of the time, what what you want it or what you do with 3C is done with PDP against this character. Because <laughs> she just goes so high. Good tech. Uh, okay, they lose the shield there. Oh, okay. That's a huge grid lead. No, what press D? No press Ooh, D. Not gonna get a convert oh. off that throw. Oh and using God. the CS flash to just hit him. Really nice. That's the classic. You do you do the stomp to be minus two and then you CS. And if they pressed anything they die. Mm -hmm. Depending on the button you can go for a trade too with ADP. Mm -hmm. ADP is just more consistent. And safer. Mm. Okay. Big spire. Frame dropping. Damn. And Atlas is just mashing his brains out. Oh! Pesto's mashing his brains out. We have a pair of mashers on the stream. In a duel of mashing, Wag should win. Wagner should be he winning the- Oh, oh no. yeah. He could have died for that. Oh, but he's gonna die for this. We got a set! Alright, so... 
five bucks on the adjustment from Aurier being the 6B. We're gonna see one this game. All right. I can feel it. I'm surprised that he oh, stayed. Oh, that was a really good trade confirm. Oh, he wasn't ready. I don't think either of them were. All right. Oh, God. The cycle's young. Yeah, you, yeah. You gotta be willing to give up the cycle potentially sometimes to frame trap someone for mashing that way. Mm -hmm. oh. These are like frame one mashes too. Oh, there it was! I told you! And then he got thrown? <laughs> Atlas said, nice adjustment, Poirier. <laughs> Haha, oh. <laughs> he smirked. Ooh, good CS. Oh, oh God, he no! <laughs> He's dead for that. Oh, I think he tried to kill you. I, I heard him say he thought he had 200 meter. Oh uh, no. Oh my God. All right, drop with the persona. Gonna get jabbed out. Oh no! The no, decision. The, that cycle loss at the end was tragic. He had it in the bag. What are the Zavari throws? Is this guilty here? Oh god. Still winnable. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Mashing. He is mashing through like a gear uh, player though. Nice 2A. We gotta fuzzy that one. Usually people will throw there, but 2A versus 2. Oh god. Uh huh. Oh man. They just have a stink. Right now, this is Atlas's oh, game to win. Right oh yeah. Oh god, what the hell? I am. Um, I don't think he's dead here though. No, he's not. He might, he might have been if uh, he had CDO available there. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is how it starts. Oh my god. He's just mashing on the combo drops. Just drop the combos and press another button. It's uni. Oh! Oh. What fuck is that? He's popping He's off. He's popping off, gamers. He he's popping off, bro. Yeah, I don't I don't know if they could hear it, but it was just like that. He was just like ah. <laughs> I hope the venue could hear. Ah, oh, no, they couldn't. Oh, they couldn't hear. Okay. That's so sad. Wait, so was that, that was winner's quarters, right? Uh, yes. Okay, so, so it's Poppy Pesto versus Salty? Uh, let me look. I think. Atlas one. Uh, it's Aura Dude and Dapoi Uchiha. Oh, oh, okay, I, I see, I know where we're at. Right. Okay. Boy Uchiha versus Oradu. Man, he has his hard fought win against Akatsuki. Not an easy matchup for Gord. Straight into Mika. Straight into Mika. Another hard matchup for Gord. Yeah, not. I'm awesome. gonna call, call them perfect. That shit is not awesome. And Jeremy's not ready for it. He said, he told me earlier, he was like, he was like, I'm not, I, I really hope I don't have to play against Oradu. The Mika's too powerful. He's still popping off. The gamer. Wait, was was that top three? Yeah, good shit. Oh yeah, I guess it is. Hey, what's up? Good to see you. Oh, good job. No! Good job. Oh, no! <laughs> this is so sad. Damn, Bunkyard, you're turning oh, well, into then... a junkyard. Dude, you're turning this into a junkyard. <laughs> no. My apologies, I came to compensate. I appreciate it. Oh. Are you getting knocked it's off It's backwards! Again? Hold on, flip it around. around. That's a cool earring. Oh, that's like your cool earrings. He has like scarab, like You're the gold the scarabs for his earrings. Down, okay? Don't worry. Chris has knocked it out, knocked it down 80 bajillion times. Alright, we need better, uh... Alright, so let's see, uh... Every setup's available Every for setup's casuals. Every setup's available casuals. Alright. No friendlies! <laughs> <laughs> Up next. Oh, we have Dapoichia and Aura. Yeah, it's Jeremy and Aura. And uh, Jeremy was telling me earlier, he was like, man, I really hope I don't have to fight Nika. 
<laughs> and here we are. Unfortunately. You know, he, he gets his he gets his close set against the Kotsky, not an easy matchup. Straight into Mika. You know. Was that Atlas Screaming? Yes, it was Atlas Screaming. Yes, that was. It was absolutely Atlas Screaming. All I'm gonna say is let it be known that my Merkava is a threat. Alright? Alright, he it sounds like he's joking, but <laughs> he is joking. No, he's. <laughs> I told him a good luck. I hope he gets his face knocked up. Oh my god, that's so mean, bro. I know. Don't worry. We got Atlas B Pesto as Orie. And then that boy Uchiha is going to play Ordu today. Oh yeah, this is going to be fun. Um, the last two times Jeremy has come out to QDB, I've taken him out as Mika. So I wonder how he feels about this matchup. Because a lot of Gordo players do not like the Mika Gordo. Well, I can tell you how he feels about the matchup. <laughs> Does he tell you? He thinks it's tough. <laughs> he thinks it's tough. Uh, for this, we had and, uh, 16. Oh. I would have to agree. You have to agree? Uh, yeah, I think so. You think so? I think it was 30. Oh, wait, is he going Wagner? Is he going Wagner? That's not oh, fair. Don't, don't, don't do this to us, Jeremy. Oh, Jeremy. Okay, there we go, there we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. He's, he's going, he, dude, he always goes my favorite gourd color. It's a really good color. It's such a good color. Eventually, when a or dude feels worthy enough of picking the good Mika color, he'll he'll do it. Yeah, for real. Because he, he keeps saying <laughs> that he, he's not worthy enough of that top. Don't do this. You, you're a fool. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Bro, oh my the god. Names, bro. Oh. I need this to happen. Dude, look at dude, look at Jeremy. He was he was like spending this whole time like worrying worrying about Mika and now he's gonna play against Merkava. Okay. There we go. So Why? I'm not like super well versed in this matchup because there just aren't there's like one Merkava player now. And uh, there were very few in the first place, but I, I would consider I feel like this one would be on the even side. It's closer to even than you would think. Yeah. Uh, it's very it's burger clear. time. Uh, unless burger time doesn't mean play Yumi anymore. I don't see them. Like, I, I feel like just on paper it would be like slight advantage Merc maybe. It's like slight advantage Merc because of Flight and like Bert and better Oki, but because of the way Flight usually oh. works, like Merkaba has to play a grounded and far range. Wouldn't Green Reaper like uh, counter pokes? Uh, it counterposes flight, so that's why Merkava stays on the floor. Ah, uh, okay. Merkava, like, bullies you with 5C and stretchy hand. A lot more, and then... Oh, God. It, it begins. It's the one homie. Okay, he's... Oh, oh no. Jeremy mashed there? What? It was the right choice. What is this? Damn, he wanted them dead. He really did. Oh, fair enough. He does not want... All right, uh, or dude has full meter here. Good trade. Uh, Jeremy gets the yeah, combo in the corner. So we'll see how this goes. I feel like so. I feel like at these these mid ranges, there's like not all that much that either character can do other than stare at each other. Mm -hmm. They both have like pretty long startup like mid range pokes. So if you have a life lead, I feel like this is a pretty decent place to be. Oh no. Oh god. Oh, bad. oh that's. With the overhead and gets... Oh no, that's not Eggy approved. All right, it's looking like a little bit of a wash, a little bit. That's one match. What is okay? Or oh, okay, okay. Make, character swap. All making right. the smart decision, you. going to. Oh, you. oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I would. Have... <laughs> Look, all I'm saying is I've never seen the character swap work. <laughs> Or, hey, or uh, most innocent show us the Nana. Uh, Don't believe no, him. To my Twitch <laughs> he said to subscribe to his Twitch yeah, subscribe if you want to one of these games. That's crazy. I'm altering history. Please don't pick Nana. Say my vision's already getting worse. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> don't don't play mute. Thank you. At least forceful step. All right. 
So we see that boy Chiha Gordo against the actual Aura dude. The true Aura dude. The true Aura dude. The actual Aura guy. The real Slim Shady. Let's go. All right, Sahu Pai Pai Beep. Well, nice try, Mosin, because now we have the Aura dude Nika on screen. Now it's time to game. Oh! Oh my god. But he's getting so much mileage out of just pressing 2B in neutral when his opponent runs forward. Mm -hmm. He's just smashing the 2B and kicking their heels. Oh! Alright, 3B gets him this combo. He's gonna side swap? Nope, just mid screen. Hmm. Alright, really good 2A catches uh, Uchiha Mashin. Oh, what was he pressing there? Uh oh. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta stop the bleeding a little bit, but going into the air against Miko is probably not gonna work out. Bad decision, DP catches you. But like, at the same time, maybe he was trying to do something about like 6-6-B. Six, six probably, um, TK, oh, okay. TK DP. I'm not actually sure what the frame advantage on that Fallen J was actually. For Miko? Oh god. I'm pretty sure uh, Miko Fallen J is plus. Yeah, he did the double overhead, so, I don't know. Ooh, really good pick up for the missile. Ooh. Oh no. Yep, that is plus. Oh my god. I, I think he. Oh, he showed me this last week. I think oh he my god. <laughs> oh no. He, he's just getting hit raw by the double overheads. Yeah. Gordon has a really hard time, like, in this situation, just trying to, like, poke out at 2C. Oh, okay, he's going back to character select. I like that. He needs a second to think. It's not real. Don't switch. I don't believe, okay, I don't believe in Uchiha's <laughs> Is he going to choose a different color, or is he just mulling over his options here? He's just mulling over his options, taking the time to breathe. Yeah, taking the time to breathe. Atonement. Alright, the map choice is really important. Very they important. already struck a bunch of stages. Yeah. Power station. Dang uh, it. Of course. course. Can't go to playground because the jungle gym is a natural boost for Mika. Mm, true. It's an interactable on. Oh, a really good 5B counter poke. He just put up a wall. Dude. Apparently that's a safe jump setup. Oh no. He, he caught he caught that 2 it with a 5A look. Oh, oh my yeah. god, the fake charge five, J5C. Oh no. He doesn't have enough resources. Oh he's to playing kill, really he? silly games, nope. Oh. Oh, I lied. Yeah. I my apologies. I don't know enough about Mika. 69. <laughs> nice. Oh my missile. god, what a masher. Do you see that? Like, frame one after that immediate button is mm -hmm. 3B. It's the button coming out. Yeah, Jeremy really doesn't want to be here. Okay. Signs of life from Jeremy. What are we looking at? What do we got? Okay. Oh, oh yeah. Or dude really held that pressure really well. The Abari 6-6-B was scary, but it worked out there. It does. It surprisingly works well, really well against Godot. I think you have a chance. Just oh, uh, he 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 got hit dash blocking. Right. Unfortunately, the oh, he's out. not holding buttons. Oh, this is how it starts. All right. Runs out all the bail off, but now has so much good. Watch to work out with. for Vio. Oh, really good grab there. What, what's he gonna do with all this meter? I'm interested. No. Oh no, unfortunate. She just catches back death by accident, bro. <laughs> Wait, was that finals? <laughs> Wait, was that finals? <laughs> Mika says it feels good to be here. No, Mika. that was not finals. He said it feels good to be carried. That's funny. Oh wait, Winner's Finals is next, so it's Aura Dude versus Atlas Omega. Oh my goodness, alright. Now, so this one's interesting, because I feel like I've seen this matchup a bunch of times, but what I haven't seen is this matchup happen this high up in the bracket. Mm -hmm. So it's different. 
Yeah, Atlas has yeah. worked really well to get to this position. Uh, this is not his first, uh, not his first top three showing, but he is becoming more consistent with it. So we're excited to see where he goes with this. Let me call these two real quick. All right. Damn, that was brutal. It was. What's my opinion on the player matchup? Um, I don't think that either one of them has necessarily played against each other a ton. Back in the day, like two years ago, when Jeremy was still like hopping on ranked and doing stuff, I would say he probably played against Aura a decent amount. But um, just from like what I know of how Uchiha plays and how I what I know about how Aura dude plays, that kind of looked like. I don't know, it, it, lo it looked kind of par for the course for both of them, you know what I mean? Like, the, the game plans were similar. Um, I, I feel like they matched up head-to-head -head there. No, no. And, uh, I don't know, Uchiha was choosing a lot of options that I think lose some value against Mika, like the, the back dashes early in the string and all that other stuff. And Aura Dude was placing Tornado as well to catch that stuff, so... Whether or not that's a result of them playing a bunch of games together, or a result of Mika Tornado being a really good move, maybe a, maybe a little bit of column A, column B, but I, I don't really feel like there was much like player player versus player mind games happening there. If that makes sense. In uh, Ordu versus Dabor, it kind of just looked like Aura knows the matchup better. Yep, absolutely. Like kind of how it should be approached. Uh, Uchiha has a lot of trouble against the Mika matchup. Well, he was backdashing so much, mm -hmm. but like he doesn't realize that Mika has a lot of options to catch those backdashes. Mika six six B and Mika tornado, okay, which are, we got him. Yeah. are her strongest options to catch backdash. Oh, for the, the next set with Atlas. Each other. Well, wow. so the thing about uh, the thing about this matchup is that I've seen these guys play against each other a bunch. Uh, I think generally Aura pulls out ahead, but. Um, I don't know, we'll see, because like I said earlier, this is, I believe, the first time they've met this high up in the bracket, so yep. like, this set now could be totally different from how they play each other, like, two two rows down, if you know what I mean. So, I, I don't know. Um, I think that uh, Aura Dude's setups, to, like, like, if, if uh, if a combo looks like it's going to drop, or looks like it was dropping or wasn't quite right, then Atlas is really prone to mashing on it. And I think that that happens a lot with Mika, where like, especially if you're r running like weird combo drop setup memes that she has, like it, it can definitely look like the combo is not going to work, right? Mm -hmm. And then you drop, but she's totally like plus 30, you know? It's not that often. It's pretty often. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's because it's the air text, right? Yeah. Like, usually when the combo drops, they're in the air. And then she just falls to the ground. And then you fall to the ground. And it looks like you can do something, but you can't. Oh, but he's playing. But none of that matters because he's playing Phonon. <laughs> he was like, you know. Oh, this is a button check. Oh, this is a button check. Okay. Fuck your stole my character. <laughs> I realized it was a button this check like five seconds in. I'm not going to lie. Th this is what happens when I invite you over for breakfast. <laughs> they play vote on wielding and then Wait, are they there. playing? What's going on? They they claim I'm an SCP. Oh my oh, god. Okay, okay. They call me an SCP for something that I didn't even do, and then they steal my character. Oh my god. But are they gonna steal your color? Don't yeah. give them any ideas. He no, would. That'd be we'll see. Let's I'm ex see. It looked. What? I'm expecting this set to either. Be a wash, or be really close. It'd be no. It no, close. it's gonna. Be, All it's right. going to be a wash if he continues the merc. Oh, he picks merc. I don't even. I should just stop talking. I don't even know what character <laughs> he's gonna play. I don't know anything. No, he's pulling out the merc. He's working. On, he's been working on the merc apparently. Apparently, we're going in. Hopefully, we can see more of it than we did against uh, Gord. You definitely have a little more room to play in neutral against, like, Wagner than with Gord. Just because, like, the buttons are smaller. Oh. Alright. 
Yeah, I don't. I don't think I've ever seen this actual matchup. Really? I don't. Think I, so. I've played this matchup a lot. Uh, which side, Merck or Wagner? Wagner. All right. What is Wagner's goal here? Um, don't get hit by five C or two and four A in neutral. Collect grid. Outplay him on his attempts to get the grid. All right. You can jump over five C and stuff like that, but um. It's it's a matchup that you definitely need to play with a little bit like resources a little bit more in mind than being in if that makes any sense. Mm -hmm. uh, it looks like it's going pretty decent so far, but this is one of those scary things where like that taking that shield buff there was really scary, you know, because he could just randomly two and four across the screen, be only minus fifteen, and then you just get hit and die there. Yeah. Especially if Merc has CS. Yeah, we'll get hit by six and C. Merc is now in the corner. Oh, he's doing no cancel 5C. He's evolved. Oh! Okay, I thought he was going to grab that. Really good toe poke to catch the grid. So is Merc going to press his broken 2B? Yes, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see it. Dude, let that shit rip. That, that, that button's impossible to beat. Oh, little buddy's out. Oh my god! Really good answer to the flight. He took him to task with that beat. Oh, oh okay. no! Alright, drop kick. See, that's something I'm familiar with. See, me getting hit by, or Wagner on screen getting hit by drop kick. Oh my god. 4B is such a big button. Oh my goodness. This, so, one of the things about this matchup. Uh, and I guess just Merc in general is that Merc is really strong at the part of Uni where he's jailing because uh -huh. he has a lot of buttons that reach pretty far and have some pretty good priority. So he's really good, like namely 4B, you know, like a, a 2B for example, uh, his 5A, all that kind of stuff. Those are like good buttons to reach around and he can definitely space around Wagner's bar A. Like, he can space around 6B1, he can space around 5B, and all that other stuff, so it's defending against him if they're playing that way is not necessarily as simple as, like, just being correct with your button press. Oh no, oh no. Mm. I'm seeing... I Aura Dude winning. Atlas knows how to play against Aura Dude's Mika, but I don't think he's seen this Mikava that often. And it's possible that he just hasn't even played against Merkava very much, like, at all. Uh, just because awesome. there, like, are none of them. Like, I am blanking, like, we have Obi Nation here at Quick Draw, but... I don't... It is Obi. Yeah, oh, okay. Obi here plays Merkava, but I don't know any other Merkava players <laughs> off the top of my head. I think it's just Obi, or Merk plays in here. This area? Yeah. Like, what about this region? Did we see, is there any Merc players that show up at the next show? Oh, oh no. Oh my god. That's, that's it. Oh wait, Dooku combo? Oh man. Hopefully it doesn't pan Ooh. out. Okay, there we go. It's like, right. hopefully it doesn't pan out into anything. Really good adaptation by Atlas over Mega. Oh! I was gonna say Atlas, dude. Oh, oh. dive cake. High profile those uh, white women normals. See, Aura has the right idea with Merc, you know? You dive kick, and then you dive kick some more. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see some more two Bs in here. He's, he's just like my practice partner was. This right. is awful. Toss out your arm. Oh god, he's stop drilling without 100 Bs. Uh, so, see, so that's, so that's what can happen to you if yeah. you just try to like randomly do it. So a lot of the times, mid screen things can far farther than mid screen as Wagner. You're kind of just collecting grid. Atlas actually punished the uh, two, 63. Oh, oh my goodness! So he did, he did. I C F F no cancel, and it was against Green Shield with, and then Merc press four B and won. I'm telling you, dude, is this, this character ridiculous? Yeah, this is winners finals. I think Atlas is maybe falling apart just a little bit. Just a little bit. Like he, I, he, he needs to suck a hit. Oh my goodness. He said all buddies. Oh, oh my no. goodness. Dude, I don't know if I would have swung on the homies and, and, uh, on him in a minute. I don't know. That's that's a lot that's of dudes. That's brave. It was a lot of dudes. Oh, all right, get the shield. Oh my. It's such a big button. That's okay. He actually, he actually spent a lot of resources for that at kind of a crucial timing. Oh, oh what? Oh. 
All right. Oh see, see, the thing that's fucked up about that is he could have killed off Wait. that. Oh my god. He, he said, I'm so mad I lost off that shit. Wait, where's the player? Where's the player cam? Oh, oh he, he's, he's composed. He's composed. Oh, at least outwardly. Yeah, he's outwardly composed. Dude, he could have killed off that combo. He needed to do 60 pickup. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, that's a nice dash bar. Really good to wait. Merc kind of has a pretty quick dash, so dash block is really good as him. Oh, yeah. Oh! All right. Gets a good break. Sets up the homies. Whoa. Oof. Oof. Gotta love the net play handshake. That is the net play handshake. You're absolutely right. Oh, dive kick! Oh, dive kick. Dude, he's just he's just gonna do it again, dude. Just do it. Oh! Oh, uh, trying to set the homies, but... He almost uh, got slapped. Ooh. So setting the homies has a hitbox. Yep. So like he almost slapped her out of the sky. That would have been nasty. That would have been nasty. Oh my goodness. Did you know the same version of setting the homies is an overhead? I did not know that, thank you. It's so bad. Oh, I guess we don't have Mercar replaced anymore. I never knew that. I learned the hard way. So oh. All I'm saying is, there's only like one of these dive kicks is what if he just dive kicked like some over and over? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, add in like two or three more dive kicks. Yeah. Oh my goodness. We smash. Tesla players love this smash. Oh, oh my god. He was just turning drill there. Why are we turning drill? Oh. Oh my oh. god. Dive kick would have killed. Dude, Atlas is calibrating right now. He is calibrated. Finish it. CDB. Alright. Oh my god, he's calibrated. Are we gonna see the character swap or is he gonna stay? Oh my god. Well, he's, he's gonna stay, bro. He's too, he's up too old. You know? And, and maybe, and maybe he's scared. Maybe he's scared of Atlas Omega. Reading his meme? Oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> I just hear fuck, dude. In the background. Oh. oh, what the heck? Oh. oh, we smashed there? Okay. He should die. You might want to just spend the meter to kill him here. No, oh, no. He wants to save for the next. Unfortunately, he gets the uh, overhead. Oh. oh. So, so one thing Aura Dude could be doing better is when he's flying up like that, instead of shooting fireballs sometimes, he should just empty fly and land with JBs and things like that. Okay. It's pretty difficult to, like, get past. It's a pretty big wall. Oh, oh really good footsies here. The footsies. Oh, oh god, he didn't footsies that one. Oh, you need you can convert. Oh, dive kick. <laughs> you have to see it coming, bro. Oh. All right, homie's out. Oh, shield no, hit, hit, hit it on like the most lastest of frames. The finalist of frames there. Oh. Uh, oh. Didn't believe match. himself. He did not believe in himself. He got the. He got the fabled single hit 2B. He did not believe himself. He did not cancel it. Hardest conversion ever. All right. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Oh. Y'all didn't hear the uh, slight groan from Ora Dude as he, he picks Care Select. He did groan. He was like, ah. Oh. Okay. If he was just JBing more and pressing 5C a little bit more, I think he would be really good though. Oh, oh my god. Oh, really, slide. really so silly. Really silly. All right. Trade. We're swapping screen sides. You see, it's funny because last set or last game's Atlas Omega was using a ton of drill, which is not that great against Merkava, but drill is really good against Mika. Yeah. Well, hopefully, he keeps Ooh. it up. Oh, boy. That was low. Oh no. 
Mika just kept building Cycle there because she was just flying forward with that drop combo. Oh god, he's dead. Uh, not, a, not a great conversion though. And he didn't have the up back there. That was a good time to up back shield. Oh no. He's just dying right now. Oh! That's close. Ah! It's not a victory lap yet. Not yet. This is Atlas Omega we're talking about. Oh my god, footsies. He said, I got a 4B too. But it's on the 6. We're in a corner with almost full resources from uh, Atlas. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, my. Okay. oh, he doesn't have the counterplay. He doesn't have the counterplay. Okay, That's not plus, is it? No. It's Down not. drill? It's not. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. That was a good block. Oh, what the? <laughs> Alright, gets him in the corner. Really good position for Atlas. He has man. shield buff. Four. Oh, God. Ooh, no, he's gonna, he's gonna command grab you. Oh, but you're, actually, you're just gonna grab him. Okay. Oh god. No. Okay. XD. Oh. XD. Wait, what did he say? Oh, I think he was trying to prevent Amika Grand Finals. I think so. This is what he was saying. It's happened twice this week. It has happened twice this week. Wait, what was the other time? Uh, hey, someone this clipped dude. that c combo from earlier. I want to see that later. Dude, you, you could have picked it up. You had to do I six know I could have. Yeah, you had to do six I, seed. I, I've never seen that. I've never done I, anything like that. So I was like, ah. I don't. I don't blame you. The moment I saw the B drill, I just started shitting my pants. I had like no <laughs> idea what was going on. Uh, can we? Can you get Trip and Chia on the stream? Trip, Chia on stream. You're the fucking TL. You should be at so we get the double Mika Grand Finals. Oh. Texas is Mika Land now. Uh, Texas is Mika Land. I don't think there's any other Mika player. Well, I meant double as in like the twice. Oh, twice. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. I played Yomi this yeah, week. Yeah, GG's, GG's. I like that set. I don't know how many people signed up for I kind of think that was the best set I've seen so far. I think it was 16. Although, although you uh, uh Salty was good too. You Salty was good. Yeah. If not only because I got to see Jeremy win. Win Jeremy. Win Jeremy. <laughs> Wait, so where this is losers finals? This is losers semis. Losers semis, okay. Yeah. So actually no, it's losers former finals. Then we do semis and then oh, we do Oh, okay, okay. Okay. See, see, you know, I know how tournaments work. Yeah! Clearly. <laughs> yeah. It yeah. happens. Uh, I used to run them for years, and I just have no idea what's going on. <laughs> I feel that. How is this possible? So we have Enki Doom versus Gordo. Maybe Mo Sin can drop, like, a, 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 a cliff notes Wait. of this matchup into the text, or into the chat, because I'm not actually really sure how this should go. I kind of feel like... Uh, I kind of feel like Gordo. I feel like Gordo should be doing fine here. Gordo Enkidu is like a pretty even. Matchup, yeah, it seems evenish to me. It's pretty uh, even. Um, if I I would argue that it's a little bit Gord advantage, but it's probably just even. I feel like Enkidu could definitely take him to task on his offense. Like there, there are things that you do have to look out for. I need this thing to update. There we go. Okay, we're Uh, the big thing is Ward's linear offense kind of hurts him. Ward's her offense hurts him a little bit in terms of things to carry. Um, the reach is better, and Ward has more consistent access to grid. Is Gord FF a projectile or a hit? It is a hit. Okay. It's a, it's a tall, long hit. Ooh, um, I wish it was a projectile, then I could FF it. Everybody wishes it was a projectile. How sick would that be? Um, the big problem is... Yeah, see, that's that's kind of what I was expecting to see. I liked that from Triplicate. That was well done. Because, like, 
Gordo's Gordo's biggest like one of his biggest problems is just that his buttons kind of suck. So or his mid range buttons just kind of suck. And Enkidu's really good at like bullying at a mid range. So I feel like on offense Enkidu probably does pretty well. On defense he probably does fine too. It seems like decent. <laughs> Right. Defense is usually fine. Gord can't get like too predictable just because of the berries existing. On the other hand, Inkyu does have to worry about the Mangrab a lot. Okay. Uh, so but the re risk reward there is a little bit skewed because the berries, I think, are a little bit better. Cool. Oh. That was rude. Yeah. That wake up 5 2 a was rude. Yeah, that's fine to be thrown there. That's not so much fine to be thrown there. Oh! Gets caught by the combo drop it. Dude, everybody's getting destroyed by combo drops. Is this a secret to beating Texas? Are we free to combo drops? We are. Because I died at combo ideas. drops like that. Trip is gaming. And can you do combo drops or OP? Dude, it's, it's so true, but also, I feel like that's just you need to some degree. Like, I, swear, I swear every character, they drop their combo and they're just like, oh, I guess it's my turn. Darn. <laughs> oh, it's I'm so plus. It's still bad for them to drop the combo, of course. Yeah, of course, but who knows? It's a Skullgirl reset. Yeah, that's the Skullgirl's reset. You're right. Oh! Uh, run up, full jump, ICJC. Oh, he mashed. I don't think if Chia was, like, playing specifically well. He does kind of look like he's, or at, least, at the very least, he's not playing with it as a priority in mind, or it's not like the main thing that's drawing what he's doing on defense. But some of the matches are a little suspect. Really good to be there. Oh, he <laughs> he side swapped. Wait, and then he hit him with a mid. Side swap mid? Is that the mix up? Oh, wait, oh, that drops. Oh. Wow. So why are you shielding? Gotta use 2C, 3C more to mash out. Yeah, probably. I don't really even know what he's like getting hit by. Okay. Oh, that that one's a classic. Oh. All right, Gort's kind of running away with it a little bit. Maybe triple kick gets antsy here, and then just like, okay, never mind. Close grab. Oh no. He went fishing, dude. Jeremy has a lot of control here, a lot of grid. Oh, oh he, he might have been able to throw that. Yeah. He need to throw that shield. What is this? Oh. Are we getting hit by this? <laughs> All right, that was. That shit looks so goofy, man. Yeah, we're we'll tied at one one. I, I like the CS uh, mix-ups here. No. <laughs> I feel like. I sense a disturbance. <laughs> In the bracket. In the bracket. Yeah, whose who voice was that? That was me and Tori's. Oh, that, that was, was me and Tori's voice. Pesto, maniacally laughing. Uh oh. I haven't heard Pesto's evil laugh yet, so he's probably playing Aurier. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's like Aurier well, like if you're honesty, you know? Like, like the emote. He has to be say so now. Oh my god! Loki, that's kind of what I want to see a little bit more. Oh, uh, misses a strip. So good to see. Uh... Oh, that's not bad. Something weird that Trip always does is that is that bail off combo. Oh. But it never. But I I'm beginning to wonder if like he always like just does it to get into bail off safely, or if it's supposed to be like a vocal strip. And he's just not. Doing it. it looked like a vocal strip and just like. I don't but know. he does it constantly. I don't know shit about fucking Hanky Doo Bro. All I know is that my 6B is Epic Abari versus this character. <laughs> Oh, he's getting he's he's getting run over a little bit on on the defense. Uh, I think he kind of got caught like trying to dash block there. He's been seeing that a lot today as everybody's getting caught dash blocking. Oh, I feel like there's not that much to say right now. 
How? Oh wait, this is that was it. That was it. Yeah. That oh, was the, uh, that was the set for uh, that boy Gia. Damn. We are waiting on one more match for the losers finals. The I combo? I think they just finished it. Yeah, they did. They okay, what's the score? I saw some good moments from Triplicate though, like especially like mostly when he was on offense. I felt like uh, he was either just barely not spacing something enough, or it was like just right. He was getting some pretty huge hits, so that was pretty good. Later on, uh, the Uchiha really got the. Um, the long range of keeping the Enkidu out because he wasn't able to see like Enkidu needs to be at a specific position on the screen to be able to like challenge any of the Gordon buttons. Yeah, I, I kind of felt like the re the real difference maker was the defense, honestly, because uh, I don't know. I, I feel that Enkidu has a good button to press to get out of that like mid-range pressure yep. like on the rebeats but um and he, and he has a dive kick but he was just kind of getting run over by a sims and stuff i feel like maybe if triplicate implements some 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 dive kick osing perhaps uh that would have helped him there because he kind of just sat there and died you know do not know if he which is. happens against gord yeah. like he has maybe he'll get hit by uh, a sim b bsm Maybe. I feel like if, if they if they call out my dive kick OS with BSM, you kind of have to give it to them. You know, you're just like, okay, I mean, shut up, first of all. But, you know. Hi, Bestie. I have to go, bye. Oh, you gone? Go later. Yeah. Yeah. He should kill uh, Pesto for us. Oh, thank you. Miss you, too. No, no. not you. Oh. <laughs> wow. I accept your kiss. Thank you. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I haven't seen you alone. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm trying to say it. Alright, we have oh, another stinky matchup <laughs> for Gord. This is the worst bracket ever. This is like the bracket he gets for like entering uni on a whim. From coming back from Melty Blood. This is what he gets for playing Gord. Oh. Oh no. I'm surprised I didn't see a B, uh, DB there. Those are some nice shields from Pesto. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Oh shit. Really good slide. Pesto, you can move without thrust. Pesto, you should flip more. Oh, oh there's God. a flip. Ooh. Oh. Really good sagger. <laughs> oh, oh my, my God. He, de he, de he decided the moment he got hit what he was going to do on Wake Up. Immediately. I respect that. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there. Oh no, there's the evil laugh. He's an Ori A player now. Oh. Oh, now this is Yuni. Okay. Lunar, if you were watching, you see how good Ori is, so you can stop complaining about it. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is really silly. This is pretty silly. Oh. It's just. I, I don't understand, dude. It's fine. Just take your turn, bro. <laughs> just take your turn. Just, yeah, just, just, yeah, just take your... <laughs> just take it back. I thought oh. he was just going to keep thrusting there. Oh, too far for the... Uh... I kind of liked the backing off and charging grid, though. Oh, Jesus. It gets hot. That was half the match and then just playing around in neutral. I feel like Pesto kind of deserved that a little bit. He was, he was definitely trying to get, you know, a little bit of a... He was trying to have his dessert too, you know. Yeah, he's trying to be cheeky a little bit. He's trying to get it all. Oop. Nice shields. All right, really good challenge. Poke beats out the dash now. Ori has the oh, uh, oh, advantage. Oh, oh. is doing a really good job with this set. Like, oh wait, this is even before the CBO. It's not what it was. Damn, this that was brutal. Is, oh, this is loser semi. I feel uh, like Papa Pesto is showcasing really well mm -hmm. why Gordo can be difficult to play in a macro sense. Because, like, <laughs> if you just... You, you As a Gord player, you should really be thinking about when you press Mortal Slide or, like, C Mortal or something like that, that it's going to cost you four blocks. You know, right. like, every time. And Papa Pesto's making good on that. You know, it's not necessarily that, like... Gordo's doing anything wrong there, it's just a symptom of how he is in the character. 
So, uh, bottom four go to. Oh my goodness. He, he's getting cooked by these, like, aerial whips and a couple overheads, actually. Oh no. Not like this. This is where Dapoi Uchiha becomes most powerful, though. <laughs> I think they could hear me. <laughs> Just take, just take your turn, oh bro. I don't understand. He, he says, just take your turn. It's just thrust. It's minus. <laughs> Although some of those might have been plus. Oh my, oh my goodness. God. Oh, what the? Oh, what? Oh, you, you can pick up from there. Oh. <laughs> All right. Dude, goes, ah. All right, what, what, are, what are we what are we gonna see? What, what's he cooking up? Does he care about the cycle? We'll see. Oh my God, she's in. Okay, she's out. Oh my God, he's in. Okay, they're out. <laughs> they're in neutral. Oh no, he's dead. Just take your turn. Just no, you can't. Damn, that's so fucked up. You really can just press spy, press that a bunch. And the thing is, that's that's fucked up is Gordo didn't have a hundred meter either. So like, what's he going to do if he just like? Says okay, well, I guess I'll be Reaper because you I blocked your thrust or something. What are you gonna do off that without meter? So what happens? Oh, it loses yeah, finals. You versus Papa. I'm just I'm just reading what he said mostly just now. The jump back JC. You know it's funny because in uh, in my crew the jump back JC has uh, has some serious lore behind it. We call it the Seven C O S. <laughs> what? We, uh, so we we have this friend oh, from seven? South America, okay. and he of course our connection is terrible, so it's like five plus frame connections. So when he tries to do dive kicks, sometimes he just does up back JC. And for some reason, it hits everyone. <laughs> what character? Thank you, dude. All right. Oh, oh Paul Kesso is going the Orient. All right, looks like this is going into it. Nope. Okay, let's see. So this is Poppy Peterson versus the Atlas Omega. The Atlas Omega. The uh, resident. Is this Wagner the first player. time he's been this high up in the bracket? Yes. I see. So he's. He's fresh off the presses right now. Yeah. Hopefully he can make uh, grand finals. That's been his hope uh, and work work towards. Ooh, really good drill. Uh, let's see, Oye versus Wagner. How do you feel about that matchup? Uh, pretty decent matchup for Wagner. Uh, although Oye's strength at controlling the screen and playing the clock is not necessarily diminished against Wagner. No okay. good. I'll say that. You know, there's no fireball for her to have to deal with. You know, there's nothing else other than what Wagner has on her person to like, put out on the screen. So, uh, if Aurier's moving back and Wagner has to go forward, pretty decent for Aurier. If it's the other way around, pretty bad. Because there's a, there's a pretty significant reward differential as well between the two characters. Is there anything Whoa! Wagner can do to catch the back dash, or is it just? Uh, she can, but you should just take a bath and do it. All right. If you're not busy at the time, it's kind of like an indirect counter. Ah, uh, CSDP, hardest thing to do in the game. Oh. See, this is where it can be kind of hard for Aurier because she doesn't have the screen space to run around in. Mm -hmm. um, so Wagner can use her similarly large buttons uh, and fast, like, ground covering specials and dash moves and stuff to kind of keep Aurier boxed in, and if Aurier gets hit, she explodes. But not necessarily the other way around, you know. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Six, six, six. Ooh! Oh, jump scare. <laughs> I'm just listening to the conversation that's going on out there. I don't know what's happening. I think Atlas is wearing his heart on his sleeve a little bit here in neutral. He really wants to get in and he pokes it. Oh, that doesn't work! Oh, kill him! Ah! <laughs> oh, she's plus nine. She's pressing buttons. Double buffs. Shield charge. Oh! Ah! Witch throw is plus! Witch throw is plus! It's plus! Did you hear that evil witch laugh? Yep, yep. 
Atlas is uh, learning from Papa. He casted a hex. Papa Pesto has been hexed now. Oh no. I feel like I'm just watching this set now in horror, waiting to see how the hex manifests itself. What tragedy are we about to witness? I'm pretty sure it was Atlas who did the left. Oh no. Oh god. Oh wait. <laughs> uh, that's that's Pop Pesto's lap. <laughs> Alright, Pop Pesto up one. So the thing is what you're seeing here is you're seeing uh how good Orie is at just kind of keeping a large uh, like a tip distance away mm -hmm. and kind of just disabling her opponent from pressing things and stuff like that. And she plays that way, it forces Wagner to, if she wants to contest Orie, take bigger risks, like do things like 660 or just like dash block, but dash block's like kind of not going to do it, but, but you have to do it, yep. you know? We'll see if we'll see if Atlas moves on to kind of that next step when he's in the corner, but right now he has Orie in the corner. And this is a lot more straightforward, I mean. Alright, Orie types out gets a turn back, but Wagner immediately oh. matches the button. Ah, what the I don't know what Orie was pressing there. Should probably kill here. Yeah. I was gonna be worried that Okay. <laughs> Wagner 6P kinda cracked true. Based button. She needs it. Oh! Oh, oh my yeah, God. that doesn't quite work. That, it, Atlas really needs a better combo there. I think he... I think it was supposed to be Missile, but he got... But he, he's been doing 660 into Missile, and it's just like not a great combo there. But whatever gets him in the corner, I guess. Yeah, it works, oh. it works. Oh. I'm kind of surprised that like for a punish, but I guess it was pretty late. Oof. Oh, God. So here's the question, does Papa Pesto just set up the spacing here and just ride it out to the end? Because I think he might be able to do it. We need we need to see Atlas make the adjustment. Oh, he's gonna borrow it. You know, Papa Pesto is like, hey, I know that I'm the one in a good position here, I've got the space, but what if I didn't though? Oh, sweet Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Papa Pesto just goes like, oh, wait! Oh, he's sticking with the Ori pick. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I think he said he was going to go all Ori this turn. All right. Oh, God. Seeing Ori assault forward with, like, JC is so weird after having played, like, 300 games with Money Tanks Ori, where he just, like, literally never does. <laughs> never does assault. <laughs> yeah, he just never assaults at you, you know, in, in neutral. It's really a player choice. Some players don't use assault at all. Some players use only assault. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, huge. Alright. He didn't have Vorpal there, so taking the shield buff off the throw is gonna be kinda weird. Oh! Trade! No! <laughs> Dude, he's screaming. He, he doesn't even know what's going on. Oh, he's so where, he, so, he's so, where are you going? What are you doing? Oh. oh! He didn't have CS that time for his memes. Okay. Oh god, he's dead. Oh, oh god, no. he's fine. Oh god, he's oh, dead. Oh, he's dead. Has when he says, hey, yo, Zenny. <laughs> he's like, see, yeah, about that. Oh okay, god. Ooh, now has to buff. Oh, that was like a plus three space to do a Tori because she walked back. That was juicy. Really good spacing. Oh, what the? Alright. Pesto's totally fine to just slight block here. There's plenty of time on the clock. Ooh, Ooh really good confirm. And a side swap. 3.2? Okay, Ori's cooking today. Oh. Alright. I'll put a new resident uh Ori made here? Alright. Perhaps. If he if he just stays spaced out, it should be okay. He keeps going in. Oh! Oh, okay. Reversal of the situation into. Oh, he's dead. Oh my goodness. Damn. Wait, so in Loser's Semis, is it first and three? This is Loser's Finals. Oh, this is Loser's Finals. Okay. Okay, so we have some more set here. Flash out. Oh my god. Who makes the desktop screen white? 
<laughs> who uses light mode this, anymore? This is the psychopath who just uses this computer. Uh, that's or dude. Oh! Oh, Jesus. Oh, okay. Okay, he, he was hunting a backdash there for sure. Oof. That is something you have to watch out for. If you, if you like to end your strings as Zorya with walking back, you do have to be careful. Black has the tools to call you out. All right. Sacred Spire, but she's still in the corner. Okay. Atlas is looking powerful right now. He is. He can bring it to a 2v2 against two. Is, is he going to make him bring out the uh, Karma? Oh, Yo, really good burn. If Pesto brings out the Carmine, he's a coward. <laughs> that's all I'm saying. Yeah, that's not VOD now. We're gonna ma make him hear it. See, this is this is the kind of situation where you're just like, oh my god, dude, I can't believe I'm playing against Torye right now. Even with like a half HP like life difference, it feels so bad. Okay, so that was a pretty dominant round from at Oh, oh no. So you're, you're kind of giving him what he wants there. You, know? you are. You just go in and, and just walk back and give him resistance. Real good food scene. Ooh! That was what? scary. Wake up, Brennan? Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know if you heard, but uh, Pop Pets will complain about uh, Wagner 6B. As, as you should. Hey. Oh. Uh, all I'm saying is, Aurier's whole thing is that she presses the button after Yoris whips, not before. That's Wagner's <laughs> thing, okay? Oh no! Alright, drill beans for us, apparently. Oh, we, he gets double buff here, so that's not small. Okay. Alright, he has no buffs. Oh, oh god, no. he's dead. Oh, 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 oh. oh no, he's alive. Okay. Okay. Whoa! Woo! Oh! oh. Wait. Oh yeah, my he, god. He ate shit for that string, bro. As much as you like seeing Karma, you can't bring it out now. That's what I'm saying, dude. Let's go, Pesto. All right, we have coming up is Grand Finals is Papa Pesto versus Aura Dude. Papa Pesto versus Aura Dude, huh? Hmm. So is he going to go Aurier against Mika? I think it's going to be Aurier versus Makava. These two have been playing their secondaries today. Oh, that's a good point. You could you could be correct. I know the I know the Aurier versus Mika matchup. Um, Did you see that they have the the, the orange crackers? I had a pack earlier, but Toon stole mine. What other ones are there? The other ones with the cheese? Well, just uh, peanut butter ones. Oh, wait. Wrong box. Uh, let's see. I think they're all the peanut butter. Nah, that's fine. Oh, wait. Yeah, you got the other all the peanut butter. This one has five grams of protein. Oh, it's four. Instead of four. Absolutely. Gotta get the muscle gain. Commentating is a real tough job. <laughs> I got a diaphragm to grow. <laughs> it is Merc versus Aurier. You're a genius. He made pesto. Prince Pesto. All right, this is Grand Finals of Richard Quick Draw Brawl. What's this? Quick Draw Brawl 21. All right, Papa Pesto versus Papa Peterson versus Atlas. No, wrong person versus Ordered. The names are wrong. The characters are wrong. We don't even know what's going on. I'm seeing eight thrusts. I'm seeing a lot of five Cs. These guys are playing quote unquote neutral with each other right now. All right, names are correct now.
the Squirt. Oh, I think Thrust beats a lot of Merc's options out here, but Flight and a lot of Merc's buttons can be Ori out the air. Yeah, but well, I feel like this matchup is very much like, the way that it's playing out in my head is just that it's very much a matchup with timings, right? Like, mm -hmm. if, if Merc presses 5C while B Thrust is starting up, then there you go, you know? But like, if the 5C whips and then the Thrust comes flying through, then Bob's your uncle. Ooh. All right. Cancel DP to make save. Oh, really good tick. Interesting throw attempt. But this mat, this is becoming unwinnable. I think it's unwinnable at 20 seconds. There's no way. Yeah, you can't win. Does, does Merc have the uh, damage potential to be able to win this at 10 seconds? No. There's no way. <laughs> Oh, now it's super over. <laughs> no! You're giving him meter! Suboptimal! Ooh, alright. 2.6, not oh. a really good turn, but uh, unfortunately doesn't take advantage of the good position. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. This is really silly time hours. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dude, he, he's got a mash on that. Oh, or a dude showing his uni prowess right here. Oh, he put down a charged homie. And he has CS. He's against a grid bro. Oh! <laughs> He said, you're a bigger simp than me. This is really sweet. Oh god. Oh my goodness. Oh, he sat down there? That's crazy. Oh. <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about. Yep. Although... <laughs> <laughs> Where's Merkama? Where is he? Whoa. Ooh, why? All right, you're a jerk you're, for even thinking that that was That was Yomi level three. Why <laughs> Why were you tossing that out there? That was the preemption of the preemption. Mm-hmm. Okay. Really good shield. Oh, God. You know, now that I think about it, it is kind of funny uh, that Merkava's, like... I, I forget which uh, which move it is that makes him just, like, zoom forward in a flip. There's 3C and then there's, like, I forget if it's 6 c or something, but... That could fly over a lot of stuff, potentially. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he says, stop thinking I'm going to do that. Stop thinking I'm going to jump. <laughs> Is Ordu giggling? Yes, both of them are giggling. <laughs> I'm telling you, silly time hours. Yeah, he went for the two thrust inputs. That's how you know he's hot. Is this the dawn of uh, Mama Peterson? Oh yeah. It could be. It could be. Because uh, Carmine's what worst character in the game, they say. Carmine doesn't have a DP, and we have all the set plays coming from Papa Peterson. Who knows? Damn. Dude, Carmine is the worst character in the game is so cap. <laughs> what do you mean? It's so cap. <laughs> ah! Oh my goodness. Rakav is so short when he crouches. Okay. Alright, really good tick though. I think that like the big difference in this set between the set where we were watching the, uh, the Orie versus Wag, mm -hmm. I think that uh, Aura Dude is playing around having block thrust in neutral a lot better. Uh, okay. yeah. It's taking a turn back much sooner. Four point five. That's some Wag damage right there. Aura's Merc is so ugly. Hey, it's ugly, but it's getting the job done. Was it three thrusts in a row? 
I think so. Look, man, what are you gonna do about it? You know? Take it. No, you can't. Oh, uh, we got double grid over here. Double board. Uh, I, I, oh, okay. I respect oh. that. That's fine. I think Papa Besto has, like, done a pretty good job today of, like, when he's walking back and waiting for something, he's he's very much, like, on the right page where he knows his opponent is, like, thinking about trying to catch him doing something. Mm -hmm. So he's just waiting there, like, no intention of pressing anything. Whoa. Oh, oh, he really needed to convert that. This round is still hard. Uh oh, really good pressure by Ori. The clock, the clock. Oh, Ori is just gonna keep him out. Look at though. the clock. Oh, even oh. <laughs> <laughs> My eyes. Dude, I almost choked on this cracker. <laughs> Oh, he finally got it! You gave it to him! Your little buddy's out. <laughs> Yo, Pesto's kind of going in on Aura right now. Absolutely. Oh! I don't think the stream can hear them talking, but we can. Yep. <laughs> Pesto's just like, you're just flying all of your grid away. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. There's some locomotion on the screen right now. Oh. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> I love Merc's 4B, man. He hits you with that, and it's, I just imagine him saying, Shut up! There's A. Oh, you can hear them? Good, 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 good. good. Dude, that's important. Ooh. Man. Oh. 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 But he, he just ate her sword. He was like, I ate your parents like this, and then he ate you too. <laughs> Wait, this is a lore matchup. Oh my goodness. I just realized. Tell Aura to stop and get alcohol on his way home, bruh. Oh, he's definitely got a drink for this. Oh. Uh. What was that jump back? What? He's, just, I, he's, I, he's I, controlling the space, you know? Controlling the things. I don't. Oh, okay. I don't see you. I don't see it. This is like me watching a Dragon Ball Z match. I. What are they doing? I feel like the thing about DBZ for me is that like it doesn't matter if you don't know what's going on, you're just like popping. Absolutely. Fucking looks really sick. I feel like I feel like I wouldn't have any idea what's going on in this game if I didn't play you. Damn. I I would I would do it. Damn. Aura does mid screen 2360 and then gets wake up rested and he's surprised. Alright. Wow. He didn't go for the pool combo. Aura doesn't have pool combos. Nice try. <laughs> Who's gonna switch? Oh my guy? god, he just ran right under her. I don't think either of them are gonna switch. I think both of them are gonna stay. He's going to switch for the bag? Nope. If anybody, I think, um, or do may switch. But I think Bob Pess is saying. I, I think you're right. If either of them swap, they're going to have the deal with me jeering at them throughout the whole night. Absolutely. Switch after reset? Hell no. Absolutely not. This guy said, I'm going Oreo. He made that decision. He's sticking with it. Not, uh, I'm going for you, but I'm scared of moves. Uh. No. Paul Preston's not that type of guy. Uh, oh my! Oh my god. Oh. I wonder how you're supposed to get my special. Why? He's just fucking pressing 5A over and over. It's so broken. Oh. 
this match is yet again approaching difficult to win territory. It's on its way. It's it's there though. It's right there. Or he only has a hundred meter. Yeah, just string him up. Just string him up. It's over. He can't win. He can't win. He can't win. Oh my god. Pesto even gave him an out. He did. Pesto, whip out the hider. You're scared. <laughs> No, I'll, I'll, I'll pass that on, Garm. I'll pass that on. No worry. Oh, he just shot the boys. Oh, he sh oh the boys are dead. What the? Oh, that's silly. I didn't think she was at the ground yet. Mm. Ooh, okay. As far as I don't see any um, stance setups from uh, Pop Vesta. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> Man, that's crazy. Oh, oh. That, he reacted this time. He reacted. Last time that situation happened, he didn't get the throw. Oh, he went for a TRM, though. Pussy. All right, that is reset. Okay, so is that is that the whole tournament, or is that the reset? That's the reset. That's the reset. Pesto, Papa says to bust out the hide unless you're scared. The hide? <laughs> yeah, Garm says pa uh, pa whip out the hide. Ooh, look at me, I'm Papa Pesto. I'm too scared to play hide. <laughs> Maybe that'll get him. All right, we're in the cafeteria. <laughs> Let's see who's about to eat. Oh my god. Oh my god. I love that move. That's still kind of winning too much. I agree. Somebody needs to put this guy in his place. Absolutely. It can't be Aura Dude with the Mika though. They have to stay these characters. Yes, they have to. We've decided. You know, we're the commentators. We made so. mm -hmm. yeah, this. Uh, they had to come through us to switch their characters. <laughs> But I don't see like a full notarized application to uh, character switch. <laughs> Man, Ori's damage is so bad. Unless it's thrust. <laughs> Wait, it still says these are semis. Shouldn't we change that to grounds? Oh, you're correct. Yeah. Show how much I pay attention. Oh. <gasps> Was that dive kick minus enough to get punished there? Or are you trying to do some points? Oh, it drops? What happens here? Oh, you got 50 seconds left? Uh, or do you? Oh, he dropped the combo. No. Goodness. Wait, right. winnable? Yo, we're gonna see throw loops? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh, I thought he was gonna do it. like a, a, a 1 DAD throw protect there or something. Or 1 ADD? I forgot how it was. Oh, the neutral. Dead homies. Huge grid lead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I agree with that. Even though like doesn't hit or do anything, I mean, he gets 60 meters. That's pretty fast. Ooh. He might even win this cycle too. Oh. Hara said no. Oh, that drops, bro. Oh, what are we looking at? Okay. Ooh. Okay, you can't really get the cycle here. Oh. He, he just like runs into him for so long. Ooh. Oh no! They just do like a normal assault, like a normal person. <laughs> oh, but he's not a normal person. He's a Carmine player. He's a he's a dude. <laughs> not a normal person. Oh my goodness. One up grab. Yeah, that Classic. Was, that was harrowing. They never see it coming. <laughs> oh, 
Everybody needs Merc 2B. You try to walk around, even Orie tries to walk around that shit. And he still gets the full gear point. That's crazy. You hear that, Jared? You're not nice. <laughs> oh. Okay, that's sort of clean. I like that bounce. I like that wall bounce. Oh. Oh, that's scary. Oh! Hey, that's super bad. Alright. Off of Pesto is at Tony Point. Yeah, and, and it's looking dominant. Oh, he's sticking, he's sticking with it! <laughs> the Aura is oh mentally defeated right now. He is. Tell Aura to play Nanase. I don't even know if I want to see the Aura Nanase. This work isn't looking like the champion. You never know. Oh. Right in the fucking face. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's that's fair enough. Just don't lose the cycle here, and then you've got like a good chance. See, he knows you want to do that though, so like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no. I'm surprised he's not doing flight JB. Oof. I feel when you go for a TRM, but you did it so fast that the regular throw tech just texts it anyway. <laughs> He said this character's so fucked up. Do you hear that shit, Luna? Luna, if you're in the chat, I need to hear you. Luna, speak up. You can't. You can't let. You can't let this complimenting go. You can't. Isn't a uh, or a bad character? Look at this. Look what Papa Pesta is doing with your character. Oh. Oh my God. Probably assault. Dit, dude. Luna's gonna be so upset. He's gonna be so upset if he sees this VOD. Oh. Is he gonna win this cycle? He's not, I guess. I'm gonna just wait. Ah. I'm sorry. I, I like this, I like this, I like this. Oh, I didn't like that one. I'm surprised I'm not seeing uh, 6B from uh, Papa Peterson here. I feel like it's just because he's, like, not close enough. That's you fair. know, most mm -hmm. of the time. He's, he's, he's very content playing this kind of like safer J-Link style. You would think, but like, Oreo 6B is mu it's much bigger hitbox than it looks like. That's true. It does reach farther. Oh, oh I wanted to God. see a third one. I want to die. I'm not even playing and I want to die. Wait. Oh, he's fucking dead. No, oh, he not. drops the combo. Oh, he did. <laughs> he does the tech. Throw to win. Oh. <laughs> and on uh, quick draw 23 cha 21 champion is Papa Peterson as Aurier. Papa Peterson as Aurier with the 3 1, then 3 0. Absolutely. In dominant fashion. He's too crazy. Alright, uh. <laughs> Yo, how do you feel about the grand finals over there, Atlas? You didn't see it? I was pretty sure from what I could say. Mosin says OD, alright. Yeah, that was a really good uh, grand finals there. I'll watch it back. You watch it back? Yeah, that was good. You're gonna cry. Will I? You will. Ah, probably. There were some fun sets today. Yeah, there were some fun sets. There was really good sets. I liked each Well, first of all, what was y'all's favorite set? Let me look at the bracket real quick. Because I really liked Uchiha Salty. I thought that was a fun set. Yeah, Uchiha Salty was really good. Yeah. Let's see. I also liked uh, Atlas, Atlas and Order. Order dude. Yeah, yeah, that was a good one. That was a good one. Let's see. That boy in Triple Kid. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That was a good I one. I gotta too. go back and watch uh, Mia Pesto's match. I didn't see yours. Let's see. I saw, I saw Ferns and Musatori. I would say my favorite would probably be. Yeah, probably Atlas or Dude. Yeah, that was, that was a fun one. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, the... Yep. Yeah, 3-0. Okay, well, we're gonna go ahead and sign off. Oh, we're signing off already, gamers. Yep. Uh, yeah. That's it. I want to thank everybody for coming out and watching. It's like, it's always a pleasure to host this event. And, uh... Hopefully we'll see you next month, uh, March 18th. You wanna... Anything happening next month? 
next month. Yeah, any uh, any games? Uh, oh, you want to announce that later? Later. They were able to, let's just say that they were able to save themselves this month. Who? Uh, they might not be selecting next month. Fine. They were able to get it this month. Fine. Maybe next month. Okay. Um, oh, by the way, um, for the match arena, if you're able to, um, come to No Blocking. That's on Fridays. They yep. run Strive and then they rotate the anime game, the other anime game. Uh, this week is Killer Instinct and. Killer Instinct. Killer Instinct and no. Blaze Blue. Killer Instinct. You guys don't know, I'm a secret Killer Instinct killer out there. Yeah. Oof, I can't wait for that this week. Then in March, March is pretty busy. So mm -hmm. Slashback is the same time as um, the next. Uh, quick drop, most likely, and then the week after that is the crossover in New York. We also have Yokai Wars 2. Yokai Wars 2 is that same weekend as crossover art. I'm not making it a crossover, but I'm going to Yokai Wars I'm 2. I'm not making a crossover, but I'm making it to Yokai. Mm -hmm. And that'll be at 3 Play Richards. Dentist? Dentist. I gotta double check. I gotta double check as well. Um, check out the Twitter. Check out the Freaks Twitter, and then I think the Quick Draw Twitter account also retweeted that because that's gonna be sick. Oh, oh, you're having it at uh, Freaks? I'm, I'm not. It's Yoke Freeplay. It's, it's Yomi. It's Yomi. Oh, okay. It's Yomi stuff. Wait, so. get Papa Peterson. Papa Peterson! Get out of here! Get out of here. <laughs> Yo, Denton? <laughs> <laughs> Best city in the world, <laughs> baby. Yeah. Yeah. baby. You gotta love that college after, sound. Oh, yeah. You'll get it after you, I get you yeah, back. Uh, what's, you, uh, what's your, uh, oh, you hold on. Yeah, you got any final yeah, thing to say about that set? Oh, about that set? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, where's uh, where's the camera? Wait, I have a, I have a question for you. Okay, let's get over. Oh, there's a camera. Okay. Before we pick your brain, I have a question for you. What's up? Do you think you're nice? <laughs> no, dude. I'm a troller, man. I'm not, I'm not nice. I'm working on it, though. I'll get there. See, lesser men than you would have said they're nice. <laughs> I was trying to bait you. <laughs> I'm playing Ori, dude. How can I say I'm nice? That's what I'm saying! <laughs> That's control. what I'm saying! That shit's so cheap. Did you see me just right, walk I'm gonna, back I'm gonna, here I'm gonna let Funkyard into, the, into the frame. That's all I needed. That's all I came for, baby. I, I just came for my sticker. I didn't come for an interview. No problem. Any yeah. final words? Um, uh, This local's awesome. Keep running it. Uh, I'll keep coming. This all is right. shit. Yeah, Alright, thanks for coming. Shit. You, you heard it from the champ, y'all. If you play Aurea, you're not nice. You're not nice. You're not nice. You're not nice. Alright. Aurea is for cringers. But this character's pretty fun. <laughs> Alright. Any final words, uh, Alice? Uh, hey, Alice, where's my sticker? <laughs> Jesus. He wants a sticker in his money. He wants a sticker real bad. Come on, come on, come on. I paid money for this shit. You did pay money for this shit. Wait, actually, this is a really big sticker, I guess. Yeah, it's a huge sticker. Sticker? Oh wait, no, maybe it's not like it's Yeah, you got like, you got paid out. Yes, you made a, you made bank. Whoa. You made bank. <laughs> thank, the, thank the venue for that because a lot of that came from the venue. I'm gonna go shake their hands. <laughs> you put this on my stick, probably. It makes space. GG's. GG's. All right. Well, thank everybody for coming out and watching Quick Draw Brawl 21. We again. Okay. Said the right number. God, I gotta get emotional. I love this community, I love this event that we get to run, and I'm so happy that I get to run it. Like, and I can't do it alone, obviously, I need help. So, to my, man, to my boy, my brother, thank you. Where's Chris? Get here! Come here! Hey, Rena, get in here! <laughs> you son of a... Hey! I can't do this shit without him either. As much as I hate him, <laughs> I can't do this without him. Don't worry, I, I hate you too. Him. I appreciate him greatly. Aww. Thanks for helping out. Oh, Rena, Rena's probably playing, but I appreciate her as well and like all the people that allow this to happen. And Sam, the owner of this venue, like it's you it's a lot. <laughs> it's yeah. a, so it's a, lot, it's a pretty so large team we've got going on. Now. Yeah, that's great. But we we kind of have to have it, honestly, all, to yeah. make this shit work. Not gonna lie, because like, two people can't run this, especially yeah. when we play like. The Especially if we're game. playing in the brackets, and yeah. we're playing in the bracket because the there's, bracket. there's no way I'm not playing in these brackets. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Like, come not. on, so there's no way I'm great. playing in these brackets. But anyway, I think I'm done with my sob, my sobbiness. <laughs> You'll probably see more of it on Twitter when I'm tired. Though. But anyway, thank you for coming out to Quirk Draw 21 and watching. We will see you next month. Bye. Peace. So,
Ayo, ore ta chi wa so, mo ka za no mono, ID mo nai, namae mo nai, kako mo minlai mo nai, ima shikanai, nani mo kawaranai, mo imi ni ikiru hiru mingai, ore la wa koko de itai, nani ga jibun no sonzai no show, make up the kato, shitsuku tell these words, achi to kochi, maru de base kai, kyo kai wa de kai, kami sama wa kohei, ore ta chi wa yubi kuwa, it's mo don to go de, sky step, ho show mo nai, Chinkin